Well, the push to regulate fantasy sports contests in Georgia goes major league. Baseball Hall of Famer Tom Glavin visited the state capitol today to show his support for House Bill 118. But as Fox 5's Claire Sims reports now, some religious groups are unhappy with the idea. The Registered Fantasy Contest Operators Act would regulate an industry that already does business here in Georgia, but some say that doesn't make it okay to legitimize it. I'm honored to have here with me an Atlanta sports icon, Tom Gladden. Retired Braves pitcher Tom Glavin throws his support behind a bill to regulate fantasy sports contests in Georgia. The World Series MVP says he plays fantasy sports and believes it strengthens the connection between players and their fans. You know, I can remember oftentimes towards uh, the end of my career when, when fantasy sports was really becoming a big thing and, and certainly fantasy baseball, um, you know, how many times I would have somebody say to me, hey, you know, I really enjoy watching you play and I have you on my fantasy team. Can you pick it up? You know, I need you to do a little bit better. House Bill 118 would require daily fantasy sports websites like FanDuel and DraftKings to register with the Department of Revenue and pay annual fees based on their profits. Oh, yeah. Representative uh, Trey uh, Kelly is the main sponsor uh, of the bill, which he says adds protections for the 1.5 million Georgians who already take part in fantasy sports contests. But Mike Griffin with the Georgia Baptist Mission Board opposes the bill and believes it's just a roundabout way of legalizing games gambling in our state. It's absolutely no different than what you saw with casinos, trying to call them destination resorts, trying to call these contests. Again, it's more lipstick on more pigs, just trying to change and trying to see people into believing it's something that it's not. But Representative Kelly argues fantasy sports are different because they are not games of chance. This is something that I believe is a game of skill, uh, much like uh, bass fishing or a golf tournament or a skeet shoot. I think I've made that clear. I'll let them spread the falsehoods that they want to. The House has already approved HB 118, and now it's up to the Senate to schedule a floor vote. Reporting at the state capitol, Claire Sims, Fox 5 News.